to submit an invoice to OPG from a standard Ariba account, you need to find the purchase order that was emailed to your company. The purchase order looks similar to this. Inside of that purchase order will be a link to process order. When you click on process order, if you have an existing Ariba account, then you could log in to submit your invoice. If you currently do not have an existing Ariba account associated to this purchase order, a screen will come up and will provide you the capability to either use an existing Ariba account if there is one set up for your company or to create a new account. To create a new account, you will click on sign up and that will create a new account for your company. If you are aware that there's an existing account for your company and you know the user ID and password, you can click on already have an account and log in. Please enter your invoice number. It must be in all uppercase letters. OPG does not accept dashes or any special characters in the invoice number. Once you've entered the invoice number, enter the invoice date. Make sure you backdate this as required. In the tax ID field, enter your government tax ID. If no tax, enter not applicable. In this category, you will select the tax. The tax typically defaults in from the purchase order. However, if you need to change it, select it from the drop down. On the right hand side, you'll see the taxable amount. That is calculated by Ariba based upon the tax category. There should be no need to enter anything in that field. For a service invoice, you must attach a copy, a backup for the invoice approver to review. Choose the file that you want to attach and click add attachment. Once you click add attachment, you will see that the attachment has been uploaded in Ariba below. Now you're ready to select the lines that you want to invoice. Click on the checkbox for the line that you want to invoice and then click create. The quantity is always one. And the unit price is the pre-tax value for that line that you wish to be paid for. Once you've entered that, click on create. On the top right hand corner of the screen, click on next. Your invoice process is almost finalized. Click on Submit after you reviewed this screen for accuracy. And once you click on Submit, the invoice has been submitted to OPG successfully.